Hello, I'm Sarah Erickson, and today I'm going to teach you how to make an Instagram bio link using Canva. If you have not used Canva before, you're going to fall in love right here, right now. And I'm going to screen share with you pretty much the whole rest of this time to show you how to do this. We're going to try and keep it fast and furious so you don't have to be here too long and you can learn. So this is Canva on a computer. You can also get Canva on your phone as an app, and you can have the free version or the paid version. Both are great. I use the paid version, but if you're not going to use it a whole, whole ton, probably don't do the paid version, just use the free version. So you're going to go to Canva. And the great thing about Canva is, is whether you're on your phone or on your laptop, everything or computer, <laughs> everything is going to share between the two. So I actually have my um, bio link that is in my Instagram right now. It looks just like this. This is where I made it. And I just started making another one right here to show you guys how easy it is to create one. So let me show you how I start this out. You're gonna to go to the search bar and you're just gonna search Instagram. Instagram bio. Nope. Okay, hold on. We're just gonna do bio link website. Biolink website, and then we're going to search that, and it's going to show us a whole bunch of templates. Okay, some of these are free, some of these are for the pro version. So make sure if you have the free version, you use a free version one. But these are all beautiful, and you can pick whichever one you feel like is going to be great for you and start editing. So I went ahead and started editing this one so I could use it as an example for you guys. So this is what it's going to look like when you start out. Um, down here is a zooming bar, so I like to zoom it in a little bit so we're a little bit closer. And then all you have to do is upload some photos. So I already have some uploaded, but if you need to upload some, just click upload media, choose your photos. So I am gonna drop in some photos into here and then we just slide these and they will drop into the frames that they, this has already created. So we're gonna move, move it around a little bit by double clicking and then dragging and you can reshape everything. Make sure you've got a nice zoom in on your face where you put your face. Then you're just gonna start editing it and making it your own. So you're gonna put your name and however you want your website, you're gonna build it to, to be as such. Now I think this one is very, very cute. I started building one just to show you guys. I think this is very, very cute. So I'm gonna jump over to the one I've already started building. It looks just like this. So here it is, okay? So you can edit this. Mine says CEO, entrepreneur, and makeup artist, or MUA, super simple. Um, and then you start adding clickable links, okay? So how you do that is super simple. So you're gonna write out whatever you want it to say. Then you're gonna go and grab the URL of whatever you want it to link to. So I want this one I'm about to do to link to my personal website. So I'm gonna go to my personal website, copy the URL, pop back over here. I'm gonna click on where I want the URL to be clickable from on this picture. Then I'm gonna click this little more button. Then I'm gonna click link and I'm going to link it here. So I've already dropped it in here, but it obviously didn't work the first time. So let's try it again. Link it here, click enter. It should underline these words when it works. Okay, so we're just gonna, gonna try and get it working. Let's see where it's gonna take us. Yep, takes us the right place. Okay, let's try and get it working here. Sometimes it can be finicky. Let's try and make sure that it's gonna link us. Oh my goodness. Okay, you're just gonna have to keep putting it in until it shows up. Looks like it's gonna show up. Okay, well, hopefully that one worked. <laughs> As you can see though, these are underlined. So I've already linked a website to this where people can fill out information to get a spa pack from me. So let's take a look at it. Now you can feel free to stalk mine on my Instagram if you wanna see it a little bit more. But they ju it just collects their information. It collects their mailing address, make sure they don't have another consultant and ask them what time, type of session they wanna to come to. So I can get some leads just from my Instagram there. Um, people can snag my monthly email. I do a monthly email, that same kind of idea. It's a Google form they fill out. Um, Let's go back to the one I already have on my Instagram. So this is what mine currently looks like on my Instagram. 
So you just kind of have to pick what do you want these links to link to. Um, right now I'm doing an event on September 13th called Pink Possibilities. So I have a link to that. So let's grab that link and put it on my new one. Okay, so I'm just making this other one just to kind of show you guys. So let's do it. Pink event. I'm just gonna say pink event. I'm gonna go to the more option, the link option, paste my link in, click enter, and it should underline it. You guys, you get to see, sometimes it just doesn't work. There it is, it underlined it. Okay, that means it's linked, okay, and so on. You can make these little bubbles down here, link to your website. Once again, this one I already have linked to my website. If we just look at it, um, we can click in and see that it already is linked. We can link it again. I guess it wasn't linked. Look, see, oops, sometimes. Got to do it a couple of times to get it to go. There we go. Links and so on. You can put your email, your phone number, all of the things. Okay, all the things. You can have um, some type of calendar that people could book a time with you if you wanted. You could have um, really whatever you want. You could link to a video of yourself. This right here, click here to learn more about what I do. It takes them to a survey um, where it's a video of me and then they can answer some questions. So, whatever you want. You build it out and once it's done, you're gonna click publish as a website. And then you click open a website. This link right up here is going to be the link you will put into your Instagram bio. And then people will be able to click and go to each of your different things when they go to this website. And it's perfectly fit to a cell phone. So it, it, the website will literally look like this on the cell phone or my website currently looks like this one so let me stop screen share and show you on my phone what mine is going to look like so you can put this in your instagram bio and your facebook bio when you click on it it should take you to the website there it is and then you can click on any of those links and it will take you to the website that you directed it to so it's pretty cool okay well there you are there you have it that's how you make a bio link for your instagram hope this helps you i'm excited to see what yours looks like and have a great rest of your day bye guys